good. All right, big game tonight here, boys. Let's go. Germany sitting with two points in preliminary round play. Switzerland 0-3. There's a shot, and that goes off an arm up and out of play from Alan Spock. He'll send it back for Meyer. Barragano. Cross ice Szymanski in his first game. Richter from him over top the net. Through the box, through the crease, under sticks. They don't have the skill to do it, so no kidding they're going to hit those, those passes deflected and not in harm's way. His plan was to play in Halifax. So a couple of situations there. Number one, the injury for Germany. Paterka plays it for Eliash as the big line with Stuttgart. On the ice, Paterka on the wraparound. More advantage of the opportunity. That's a really nice play down low by Stutzla. He kind of maneuvers the puck around here. And Paterka just grabs it and wraps it in and around. He knows right before he grabs that puck that Fantas is in trouble and he makes him pay for it. Nice play by Paterka. in the tournament. At the line for Guggenheim, trying to hold it in. He got bodied off the foot. Yeah. When you get your players back, there's no complaining from Germany in that respect. In across the line, backhand shot by Zimmerman, turned away to the forehand camp. And Shanton at the line. Barragano gets it down low. Marchand with a backhand shot. Can't. Also gives him less opportunity. He's got to hope that somewhere along the line, Bugle opens up either between the legs or on the short. With the opportunity on the forehand with more net to look at while we're closing it down. Stutzla busted oh. away and scores! <laughs> Unbelievable. He breaks. Watch the lower body leverage. He gets underneath Fiedler and he never loses sight of the puck. Now, if you're Marco Bayer, you want to keep this at one nothing. You know your team doesn't score much. But when you have lots of skill like Tim Stutzla, you can make those plays. There's a chance. Stutzla. Stutzla looking over at the referee. He thought there should have been another penalty. Here comes Canuck, shorthanded. Bugle save on the short side. Zimmerman. Zimmerman giving chase. Cleared back to the near side. Backhanded to the short side by Munzenberger. Eliash doesn't pick it up. The third will put neither. Now Eliash gets a second try. Comes in, lets the shot go. Save made. And now Ganip will take over. Slips it around the boards, but Jovanis first on it. Sharp angle. Schlapper chips it in, goes in after it. Hunsenberger gets hauled down. And a penalty coming to Bettini. Go to the penalty box for that. With their number 20, Meyer fell the tripping. Albert, Paterka. Stutzla, Ganip, Stutzla off the pipe, rebound for Eliash and he couldn't get it. Turka, I mean Stutzla pounds this one and Fantoy gets a piece of it with his glove before. Albert plays it for Paterka, five on three for Germany. Stutzla, shot score! But then Stutzla, Paterka go to work and Paterka buries this. Fanton doesn't even have a chance to get over there. And keep in mind that Stutzla, when he's up there, he can wing that puck right from there. So as a goaltender, you have... Wait, eight minutes and 14 seconds. Paterka and Stutzla, two on one. Cross ice pass, and it just tipped off. Power play over. Fiedler takes it from Meyer. Fiedler's shot. And that went off a body in front. It didn't miss by much. Well, there was some activity around the German net, and the puck goes off of a player, off of another player, just wide of the net. 17, where Nico Hischer showed everybody on the planet that he was a top-notch player. Marchand puts on the brakes. Schlachter waits for it. Fiedler from the line. Shot, rebound, in front of the net. Oh, what a chance. Olympic wrestling tournament was taking place in front of the net. There's the play. What a what a play by Bugle there with the right arm. Quick to react, moves. Kinda, again, there's a perfect example, Switzerland. The puck's right there, the net's wide open, it doesn't sit there for Battini. Got a stick on that, grabbed off by Paterka. 
for Albert. Albert tried to walk it in, does, gets a backhander through. Eliash leaves for Ganip, in for Stutzla. Stutzla takes it wide, goes short side, rebound for Albert. Bottom, swings around Fiedler. And then right here as he tries to get it up on the short side, right up off the mask of Fat Tom. And that's why the play was whistled down. We saw the terrific shot by Sin. Show back at the line. Shot rebound, and that just inches its way past the open side. Pass up the middle with off a stiff. Eliash on the steal. Wires it. Save rebound. Goose puck in front. And a penalty coming up. Team minor penalty cross deck. Giveaway and Elias jumps all over it. Very decisive when he gets in there, he's gonna shoot it and that right pad come right out there. It's amazing. You have Elias here as one of the tournament's leading scorers. Simon Kanak. Trying to find some skating room there against the Turka with a dozen seconds. On for the Turka, back for Stutzla. Stutzla walks it into the slot, scores! Nice play as they enter the zone. Just a little back pass off the boards, and then Stutzla, he recognizes it. He's got all kinds of time, space, and he buries it, makes no mistake about it. And unbelievable. The skill level that he even practiced time very much of it. They had it right before the first game, but they didn't have the benefit. Trigger for Zimmerman, and the wrister save made. You know, being overwhelmed. The battle Bettini sends it in, turned away by Bugle. Delamont from the line, left half save made by Bugle. Still just don't have the finishers. Paterka, Eliash, and another save by Faton, point blank range. And now Stutzla, Kanak back for Barragano. At the line, Meyer, Kanak, sharp angle, Bugle down, rebound, and that got stuffed wide, but they will look at it. Can I do that in center? Uh, uh, go ahead, in the period. Paterka, long shot, another save by Faton, and that will bring the period to an end. Good play there by Ballins and Hofer. Good play down the ice. Lionel Marchand will give chase. And now chips it through. Reidsnecker trying to get a stick on it. Kent. Spinning, firing, save made. Rebound. Reidsnecker gets a whack at it. From Simon Kanak. And Bugle may have got a piece of that with his blocker. Back in for Meyer. Pizzuto gets away from Flory and Aliash. Wrist shot, love save, and good despite the fact being 0 and 3, oh! with a chance to still get in. Short-handed chance by Paterka. Sends it cross ice. There's the long lead pass. Bullock going in. Save made by Faton. Shot score. Delamont with the shot from the line. May have been tipped in front, and Switzerland is on the board. You know, so the enthusiasm they had, it comes back to the point, and then a little quick turn by Delamont, and he gets it to the net. Kind of a delay as it was moving towards the net. And that gets caught up in between the pads. I'm not sure if Allspach or Allspach. For Shanton at the line as he jumps in. Shanton in a battle with Eliash. Eliash trying to get away from him. Good pressure here, Chantal keeps the puck alive, pitching in, no sense trying to protect the 4-1 deficit, and Ilyas just is not able to corral the puck, and Ronnie Dollar steps right into it, beyond the outstretched glove of Florian Bugle, all of a sudden it's 4-2. Pizzuto, Pizzuto shot, that got blocked. Taken there by Stutzla. Good block there by Paterka. Paterka with two in the game. Paterka scores! In that approach, and then he gets the puck here. 
tries to shoot it, but it gets blocked. But then Paterka goes to work, fighting off the determined checking of Switzerland and completes the hat trick. I don't know if he was trying to break his stick or he was just kind of flexing. I wouldn't be giving Tim Stutzler an assist on that because he tried to fire and went off the Swiss player. But... So Switzerland to the power play for what's left on the clock. Shot. Score! Here, but Noah Meyer gets the puck back and he, he gets it through. That's the key. Good screen in front. I don't think Fuss tipped it. But he created some distraction for the goaltender. No, it went right off the post and the play right off the post and then in off the back of three shots. Here comes Schlapper. Plays it back at the line for Meyer. Another shot. Oh, big save. And it goes off the stick of Barragano and out. Meyer brings it back in. Meyer through for Simon Canuck. Scores! The clock. It looked as though it ran for maybe a second or a second and a half. What a nice play by Noah Meyer to just feather it in to the streaky Simon Canuck. And then Canuck. Again, off the post and in beyond the outstretched glove hand of Bugle. As Germany hangs on to defeat Switzerland, 5-4 to four, Germany will climb to third place in the A pool and advance to the quarterfinals for the first time in 13 tries.